see how difficult this is. Oh, I had to get another Elite Four Orb. Ooh, that's going to give me four to hold on to for Invisible Woman. So, yeah. That's what we're going to go for. All right. Fighting the... I don't know what the story is. Oh, look. It's a Phoenix and a Dark Phoenix. You can tell she's Dark Phoenix because her eyes are red. Oh, wait, no. She's not Dark Phoenix. She's just Bad Phoenix. That's what that is. Jean Grey, you reclaim what you let free. You're a remnant of the Phoenix's power. I'm here to bring you back into the Phoenix Force. Uh, my power has grown since arriving. I've become one with this place. Would you separate the stars from the sky? If it meant preventing the end of all things. Nobody was talking to you, Scarlet. Then come and try and experience an end of your own. <laughs> end of your own. Wow, trickle, wow, wow. All right. Um, this team is probably a little overwhelming. I should have never, ever, ever put resources into Hand Assassin. That was a total waste of money. I got her up to, like, I think level 55 or 58 or something to max out her abilities. Oh, my God. I regret that so much. Uh, you really just need, like, Ronin, Mordo, and... and Loki is plenty. Oh, and you get a Phoenix and a Scarlet. Oh my god. This is going to be so easy. Oh. Alright, let's debuff her. Defense down, slow. Oh, there's 11 enemies. I assume that means that we need to hit her a bunch. And then, oh, that means Colossus is probably going to deflect up and stuff. Let's see. Uh, I think we want to kill Mantis, actually. She's kind of annoying. She's also got her um, stun ready. Ooh, ouch. Poor dude. All right, actually, let's uh, let's uh, do the heal blocks here. And boom, got her. All right, that works. Uh, next thing, we got to get rid of Colossus. He's going to be so annoying if they drop any more um, X-Men down. Uh, I guess we'll call in this guy's minions because we can. Oh, shit balls. That's not good. That's not good. Uh, let's get rid of that stuff. That's a good timing on that uh, ability. Oh my gosh. That did like no damage to her. Holy shit. And when I hit her to half health, she's gonna... Oh, wow. This is bad. Um, I need to stun some... Oh god. I'm not gonna be able to kill him fast enough. I might have fucked this up already. Let's do this. Let's get everybody... Yeah. Oof. Ouch, this is gonna hurt. Thankfully some of them have evade, but I have my own, so maybe that Dark Phoenix is enough. This is really stupid. <laughs> Shit. Alright, let's stun the stranger. Okay, that works too. Oh, Minerva, too. Oh, my God. Wow. He's going to miss. Or not. Oh, there's no buffs to flip. Derp. God. I am playing this all sorts of wrong. Um, but that's okay. Let's get rid of those buffs. Oh, shit balls. Ah. Uh. Uh, let's get rid of Minerva. She's annoying. Can neither of you hit anything hard? Ah! So annoying. Alright, let's get rid of those def the death proofs. And let's get rid of him. Oh no. We gotta get rid of this rocket. He's gonna hurt. Ouch. Don't. No! Oh, he got a revive from Nobu! <laughs> Nobu finally did something useful! Oh, I forgot about that. That was a bad idea. Oh my god, I'm playing this so badly. <laughs> Alright, let's get rid of Mantis. And we gotta kill this rocket. Okay, so I'm gonna hit in the middle here. I think that'll remove his death proofs. That's good. And we got... Oh my god. Alright. Um, let's put a debuff on him. Offense down, that's fine. Uh, let's get rid of those debuffs. We need more turns from... What's-her-face? Phoenix... Uh, more debuffs. Give me defense down. All right. Um, let's just get rid of all those buffs. That's fine. Ah, oh, he he resisted it. No. All right. Perfect. 
Ronin is awesome, man. All right, let's steal some health. Oh, they still can. Oh my God, another Nobu revive. How awesome is that? I played this so horribly, so, so horribly, and it's like, I'm still going to do it, so that's pretty cool. I mean, it's something. Let's put some debuffs on them, get rid of that. Yeah. Get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that guy. Oh, I didn't kill him. This will kill him. This will do it. Man. That's quite the animation. I've seen the Phoenix's power run amok before firsthand. You were never going to win this little shard. <laughs> shard. Come home. Isn't that what they told Jean? Like, come home before she, like, killed Xavier? You've reabsorbed her? Huh. She was never real. Not really. With the full Phoenix recovered the crystal, and your mystic powers, we should be able to re-enter this dimension and make it Ultimus's tomb. I didn't think it could be done. Maybe next time, Mordo. You'll have a little more faith. <laughs> Alright. Look at that shit. Alright. We got four! Four Elite Four orbs to hold on to. It's perfect. When Invisible Woman comes out in a couple of weeks, I will be ready. Maybe I'll be able to save my tokens so I can purchase a four, star, a four red star upgrade on somebody else if I can land her in that orb. So we'll see. All right, payday. Uh, might as well knock that out. All right, no, no, no. Let's go, of course. Let's go upgrade the Phoenixes. Okie doke. She's at 57k power, and we have money now, so we can upgrade her. Get her to seven stars. Woo! A little bit of an upgrade, 5k power, 100, or well, just under 100k health, so she can still get one shot by Ultron's beam, which is real nice, assuming he has offense up. So you can get her on turn one when the computer is stupid. Um, that's pretty cool. Let's see. I don't really need to upgrade anything else, but that's nice. I guess I should go check my arena rank, see if all the other seven star phoenixes have passed me by. No. Not yet. Let's go take her for a spin. I've been playing around with a very fun team lately just for the heck of it. So there's a lot of Draxes. And uh, the Draxes kind of ruined the whole first turn disrupt on Ultron strategy. So everybody's kind of moved to Drax just to prevent Ultron from getting disrupted on turn one. Um, let's see. So, Vision or Colossus. I kind of like this one. Let's hit this, uh, well, see, they both have seven star. Everybody's got seven star Phoenix now. Yeah, so it's just gonna, anybody who's in the top 20 is probably gonna have that. Um, man, look at these teams. So similar. 58k, 55k, 57k. Three red star, four red star, four red star. <laughs> Hmm. And I guess the Stark tech is the difference on these, and it looks like he did not upgrade one of his abilities with T4s. Shame, shame, shame. Ultron re deserves all of them. But anyway, let's uh, let's see. Who's the higher power? This is 290. Let's hit this guy. Okay, so something fun I've been doing lately. Uh, this is just for the heck of it. It'll work better with a 7-star Phoenix. But I've been using Falcon, and uh, check this out. 50% of the time, it works all the time. And uh, it's a lot of fun to play with. I'll, I'll show you. This is just kind of a bonus. But it is hilarious when it does work because it's just, I don't know, it just makes me happy. All right. So first turn, you got Drax and whatever taunt. Uh, she does her beam. She hasn't one-shot anyone anymore, by the way, even with like five red stars. Like, I don't know why I put people put Captain Marvel on defense. I really don't get it. Without any military, she only gets one turn of binary, so it's like, whatever. Anyway, we're going to do invisible thing on turn one. There's no uh, Magnetos to worry about, so you don't have to worry about the blind later. But check this out. So Falcon went first here, and let's see if this works. Come on, make it happen. Damn it! He resisted it! <laughs> 
Stupid fucking Ultron. Alright, sometimes that pulls Ultron out of stealth, and then you drop the ability block from Vision on him, and it works. Let's see if I can get the 50-50 to work. Nope, it hit Captain Marvel. But, anyway, half the time this works, it's just, I don't know what the resistance focus check is. It, yeah, makes me sad. But, anyways, um, it is hilarious. I'm going to throw the disrupt on Drax, though, so that he can't uh, do his thing. He has very low resistance, so it always pulls him out of stealth. Most of the time it pulls vision, too. Um, more than half the time, I would say it pulls Ultron out, too, but he didn't do it this time. So, disappointed in that, but that's okay. Let's try to... But here's the other thing. Because I used that Falcon ult, my guys go before his. And so what I can do is burn his accelerator so nobody gets speed up. He gets speed from it, but that's it. And that's really not a big deal. And then I get the offense up. And then I get the green guy to go. And look at all this turn meter my Ultron gets. So while I'm doing my ult with only three uh, energy, so I don't get quite as much energy in return with Ultron, it's still actually quite a bit of, of stuff you get. And then you follow it up. Now check this out. Offense up, uh, Falcon sometimes kills the minions, but if it doesn't, Vision follows right up with a buff removal, and then you just screw them over. So in my experience, I've been using this towards the end of uh, payout timers to clear out the enemies much, much faster. All right, let's steal all those buffs from him. That's perfect. And uh, then we'll get the first Ultron kill here in uh, just a sec, because he's about to go. And uh, let's see him ult with no no buffs, and he did it on my Phoenix. <laughs> Hilarious. All right, so we'll kill those guys. Uh, we'll go after Phoenix, because she's the biggest threat. Put offense down on her. That does help on her ult. And uh, yeah, just kill her, kill Ultron. And then we just got a Captain Marvel to clean up, who did absolutely nothing in this. I don't know why people put her on defense, just like Minerva. I don't get it. They don't do anything. It's just, they're straight damage for the most part. Very little help from a NPC-controlled standpoint. And uh, it's just hilarious. Like, this team is just, it's a total, like, mix-up of turn order. It's not the traditional, you know, disrupt Ultron turn one, because there's Draxes everywhere now. And the other cool thing is because they have Drax, he's going to have uh, Taunt, so he actually gives you an extra 5% speed just because of the uh, the way that the Falcon thing works, and so it works. Uh, it's just for fun. Like I, I really like my Power Armor team, so I've invested a ton in them, so I'm trying to work them into other things. Like I can swap out Vision for War Machine to guarantee that Falcon goes first, uh, but then I lose the buff removal option. However, I get the big damage from War Machine, and... That can be fun, too. I don't know. There's a lot of variations to this that work really well. But throwing in Falcon is actually pretty cool. And if you get the uh, if you get the stealth removal on him with the Falcon special, it's actually pretty great. Uh, Seven Star Phoenix didn't do a whole lot there. Sorry. You know, that's how it goes. But uh, it, it is a uh, <clears throat> kind of a crapshoot whether or not he resists it. But anyway... Fun team to play with, 7-star Phoenix, so there you go.